Hi folks, County Line Gardener here. Uh, sorry I've been uh, neglecting my garden duties here a little bit. I got this this big uh, train set going here and uh, well I've just concentrated on it a little more. I mean I'm still doing my gardening. My wife's doing her share. She's doing more than her share but you can see down here at the bottom look how tall some of these plants are. They're going to the greenhouse today. That uh, that pink flower there, there's a there's a little story behind that. Uh, we'll keep on going down through. Here's the peppers. They're not they're not as tall yet, but they're getting there. They're getting there. Some more tomatoes. This was totally full down through here of tomatoes and the top all the way down to the window there. We have taken that many to the greenhouse, and I'll show you that here shortly. Uh, we're going out there too. Um, but this uh, pink flower here, see how pretty that is? Those are my wife's coleus. And she comes home and uh, she's got her little part-time job in town. She works about five hours a day. And uh, she always checks that. Checks them flowers, waters them. Well, she does everything. Tomatoes, peppers, but anyway. I found, I don't know where I found them flowers. They're artificial. They're artificial plastic flowers, but they look so real. I stuck them in that seed soil there. In one that wasn't growing. And she come home just all excited, and I told her. <laughs> I went on for about an hour, and finally I had to tell her the truth. Oh man, here's, here's the other side of that, that train set. Uh, I'm working on it a little bit. Uh, I'm, uh, this is the setup set place for the, for the trains. That's where they set them, that's where they put them together. Here's a, a small roundhouse. There's a six, six uh, stall roundhouse. There's a, oh, that's where the facility where they, <coughs> excuse me, work on train uh, engines. Over there they work on train cars. It's big enough for uh, passenger trains. <coughs> Here's going to be my passenger train. It's the Monon. It used to be here in southern Indiana. Oh, uh, in, in Indiana from one end to the other. Uh, I'm going to run around here. There's my wife's coleus. There's our co oh, cucumbers up there at the top. <coughs> Excuse me again, there's some more. Those are going out today. Those are going out today. It's a nice day here in this southern Indiana. Uh, my wife did all this, all this diorama. She built the house. She built the garage or the barn. She built the silo. She put up that fence over there. Uh, she built, I had to build the uh, windmill for her because it was a little complicated. No more bigger than that thing is. And this is my water. Uh, this is my water. Uh, it's polyurethane's what it is. It turns, it turns, it's white now, but it will turn clear. So we'll see. We'll see. We cer certainly hope so. But uh, let's go on out to the greenhouse. I got to get out there. After a while, uh, I'll take I'll take this golf car out there. After a while, this is my wife's golf car here, the newer one, of course. I got the old 90, 92 model here, but she come home with these darn things. One foot square concrete pad she wants in front of the greenhouse out there, so we don't get muddy, which is a good deal. Good idea. Let's go on out there. Well, let's see here. Oh, hope I got enough uh, power in it. I haven't charged it for a few days. <coughs> oh, it's a beautiful sunny day here. Uh, southern Indiana. Birds are out. That maple tree is taking its time blooming. I might rile up the dogs here, so just ignore that if you hear. We uh, we added some more some more raised beds. If you noticed, we had. To, Let's see, we had one, two, three, four, we had six, and I, you can tell the ones I, the new ones there, treated wood. Uh, I didn't use the, uh, that is roofing what it is, that metal there. Uh, well, they're nice, they work great, but I use these. 
I made these out of five quarter deck boards and four before, that's all I used. Now they're eight footers and they're put together. Over here's one. I gotta figure, I gotta get some stumps and big old tree limbs to put in the bottom so I don't have to fill them up too much with with the compost. We uh, we go to the compost dealer, uh, landscaper, and they bring us down a great big dump load of uh, uh, compost every year. About three three hundred and fifty dollars, but man, it sure makes stuff grow. Okay, let's stop it here. Ah, let's go in the greenhouse. Let's see what we got in there. There's my little deck. I made a video of that if you guys will remember. I think I can turn my bird bath upside or right side up now and fill it full of water. Uh, blackberries are down there. They're doing great. They're starting to bloom. Up here at the top, you know, if you'll recall, uh, that's my uh, bed garden. 350 by 125, between 125 and 150. Uh, I don't know how, you know, it, it vary. I took the fence down last summer. Man, that helped a bunch. I had an electric fence up up there. Five strands. It was about three, four feet high. But I took it down. I figured if they want it, they can have it now. I'm getting older and I just don't. If they eat, they won't eat it all anyway. Okay, let's go in here. Let's see. My wife's been out here because she's turned the heat off. There's our heat up there. We got two of those. And they do the job. They do the job. But you can tell. You've seen this all before. There's what we've got in here now. Look how they're growing. They're growing great. I don't see any weaklings out here. And there's something I'm proud of this year. I've never grown a carrot in my life. But I am this year. And I'm real proud of that proud of that that that's I've never grown a carrot we'll go ahead and open the window up here let it get some air in here ah, let's see uh, I don't know if this one will work or not this one's having trouble with this one well, I guess it will there we go <coughs> excuse me again well that that that's about it uh, that going thing leaks these this plastic that I put over the greenhouse the clear plastic here you see is only a oh, quarter inch thick it's floppy it's floppy but I used it on the roof of course well the wind got under it and blew some of it off a little bit at a time until finally it's it's broke up there and I had to piece it back up there and it's cracked and it leaks and uh, my wife said don't worry about it she said that leak and that you know she waters it every night anyway so uh, I didn't argue with that I don't argue with not having to do anything I'm pretty good at that anymore but uh, I guess that's it for now uh, you guys have a sorry I've neglected uh, videos this will be the April yeah April update on the on the greenhouse and the seedling greenhouse and boy next month uh i'll try, let's say in may i'll be uh, i'll be putting them in the ground about a month from today about a month from today so uh we'll get off of here the birds are back they're in my bird houses i love to sit on that back deck there and watch my birds there's a couple right there uh there's four bird houses down through there and there's four over there and I got them up and down that big fence row up there. I like to watch my birds. Well, this is County Line Gardener, folks. I'm, I'm going to get off of here and get to work on these steps, I guess. So I'll see you later. Bye-bye.